Hello again YouTube. A quick little video um, just showing you how to use an empty pop can or beer can. How to make an emergency whistle. Dead simple, dead easy. Here we go. You can use either a knife if you've got a survival knife if you're in that sort of a situation but it is easy with a pair of scissors or you know uh, steel shears. So I'm just going to use a pair of old kitchen scissors. So basically We'll start by just cutting into the can. We'll remove the top completely. Just hack that off, rough and ready. Now, what I'm going to do is just cut straight down to the bottom and cut another piece of material off about a centimetre in width down to the bottom, like so. I'm going to then carefully, because these, these things are like razors, so be careful if you attempt this. Snip that piece of material off and straighten up the jagged edges. Just snip those little bit, bits off. So I'm left with a strip, approximately a centimetre, maybe a bit more. Like so. Now, what I'm going to do again is another strip like I say be very careful when you're doing anything with this sort of material it's you could actually use this for skinning an animal it's very short <clears throat> so what we do is snip this down to a smaller size and we take We'll take the smaller piece like so, bend one end round, bend the other side around also. So on the other side you've got that and the, the piece that's sticking out, this is probably about five millimetres, fold that back over the joint so you're left with a piece that's been wrapped around and secured into place by that little tab. Now what we do is, using again the scissors, the knife, whatever you have to hand, we insert underneath that little piece, in fact I'll probably use a small knife here, it's just easier to get under, and basically we just want a slight, slight bend to create an opening, a very small opening. Like so, so you, you've just got a small, I don't know if you can see, small bit of daylight through there. Now what we do is we roll, we roll the remainder towards the back of what is now the mouthpiece. Okay, and using your, four, your finger and thumb, you pinch the two sides to create an air cavity. Bend the piece down like so, and hopefully, we should be able to get a uh, sound out of this. <whistles> Nearly. <laughs> it takes a bit of uh, bit of practice. It can be a bit fickle holding this in the right position sometimes, but. <whistles> But there we have it anyway, it's a, it's a simple way of making a, a simple reusable survival emergency whistle. There you go. Dead simple, dead straightforward as ever. Not the best demonstration, but as you can see it works, it is effective. <clears throat> And on the subject of emergency whistles, I guess most of you know anyway, but the International um, Rescue uh, Signal, um, whether it be light, sound, whistle, flame, whatever method of attraction you're using, is six hard, long blasts 
followed by 30 seconds to a minute rest, six long hard blasts again, three times in, in repetition. And that's the international um, distress call. Other than the SOS, you know, the dot, dot, dash, dash, dot, dot. Um, so yeah, how to make a simple whistle out of a Coke can. See you for the next one. Take care.